Hey, what's going on, guys? How's everyone doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Well, just had another movie night uh, yesterday, October the 2nd. Uh, we have little movie nights uh, kind of starting at the end of September, going on through the end of October on Saturday nights, uh, outside, uh, on the projector, and uh, during those moments, I do little clips and just small, quick clips and uh, little pictures and just kind of, you know, dictate kind of my my nights. And uh, anyway, and I put them together and I make a little video later on after it's all said and done. But uh, and this year, I'm kind of doing a discussion on all the movies that we watch, which are, it's only going to be a handful of movies. And... This movie is one that I just randomly found and downloaded and we watched. This movie's called Bad Candy. It's an anthology type movie where you've got stories throughout, different stories, and they're all supposed to kind of connect and, and all that kind of stuff. And at the end of the, kind of at the end of the movie, you know, everything's supposed to kind of make sense. Uh, I, I don't really have anything positive to say about this movie. This is going to be a short discussion. Uh, the only actor you need to, you need to even know is, and I'm going to butcher his last name, uh, Zach Galligan as Paul. He played Billy in Gremlins. Everybody else in there. I, I, I think Corey Taylor is from a, a band. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, he plays Chili Billy. And uh, there's a, a bunch of other characters, a bunch of other stuff going on. Now, the thing that drew me to this movie was uh, it's set in Halloween. You know, how, uh, during the season of Halloween and all that. And it, and it delivered on that. Uh, it, it was full of all kinds of Halloween decorations and parties and, you know, costumes, all that kind of stuff. It delivers on that. And I'm going to go ahead and say some more positives uh, if I can find something. Anthologies, of course, are different kind of stories uh, in, in one movie. Uh, this movie, had they taken one or two of the little movies, one of you know, the shorts, the stories, the whatever, if they had taken maybe one or two of them and, and actually made a real feature length movie out of it and put some time and effort into it I think that you could have had a decent a uh, decent story with uh, a couple of these stories in here but the way that they're thrown together in here is just awful I mean it's you can't even understand what's going on uh, the stories feel incomplete you don't feel like you're getting anywhere and by the end of the movie you're just sitting there going what did I just watch? What is even going on? And I feel bad for uh, the people, you know, the writers, the directors and all that. Director Scott B. Hansen, Desiree Connell, writers Desiree Connell, Scott B. Hansen, Thacker Hoffman. Uh, you know, I, I feel bad. I know that they had kind of some idea going on here and, uh, and I like anthologies if they're done correctly. Um, but this was not done correctly. I mean, even my nephew, you know, I have people over on the movie night. And we watch movies. Uh, of course, he was the only one here last night. But even he was sitting there going, what is even happening? What's the story? What's, they're not connecting nothing. I don't even get what's going on. And he's pretty good at following along with stuff. He's a little bit quicker in the old brain than than me and uh, even he was just sitting there going this is horrible this is no there isn't that's bad uh and i at least tried to find some good as far as like the setting you know and uh the time you know the how they did with all the you know the sets and the bringing halloween really out there in the forefront and they did a good job with that uh the cinematography there's some great cinematography some good lighting the acting is you know subpar it's, you know it's what you would expect in something like this there are a couple of freaky moments there's some good kills uh you know there's something there that could get your interest but they just they failed 
it's an absolute failure. And uh, that's about all you can say about this movie, guys. Uh, it had some cool potential, but at the end of the day, it failed. It's absolutely... Uh, it, it, it just it's not complete something's not complete there's not a connection in there it's not clear if there is a connection it's not clear enough you shouldn't have to sit here and, and, and you shouldn't have to go back and watch a movie you know uh, to at least understand a little bit now some movies you do have to go back and rewatch and kind of rewatch and oh yeah okay I get it all right yeah but you don't want to have to do that with a movie like this. It's a horror movie. It's a low budget. Let's get the story complete. Let's make sure that uh, people are going to know what the heck you're doing. Uh, what you're trying to say, you know. And uh, this movie failed completely in that aspect. So, anyway. Uh, I'm not, as you can tell, I'm not putting a whole lot of time and effort into this discussion. I'm not doing all the clips and all the stuff and... Uh, that I normally would do and spend a lot of time with it so uh, it's not worth it so anyway there are some goods like I mentioned but at the end of the day the story and the writing and all that is what counts and it fails miserably on that and I don't typically give ratings but if I had to give a rating to this movie it would maybe maybe be a 4 out of 10 and like I said you know, the four is just coming from the good that's it that I uh, uh, mentioned and that's it so guys I say stay away from this one unless you are wanting some punishment uh, yeah anyway uh, execution failed guys if you like what you see here check out my playlist you'll see all kinds of good stuff from movie discussions to video games and working out and everything else in between you're gonna find some go check out the playlist like share subscribe comment all that good stuff to Mikey Sin TV and don't forget guys get up get out get rad do it to it just don't involve this movie see y'all later Get up, get out, get ran and do it, do it!